Hey guys, so today I'm working on a 2014 Ford Taurus and I was checking the fluids, you know, you got your windshield wiper fluid, you got your coolant, um, you know, you got your uh, AC valves there, uh, you know, the area where you put your oil in, the spot where you check your oil, you know, your dipstick, oil dipstick, um, and you know, I was doing some regular basic uh, maintenance on it, just checking fluids and stuff like that. And you know, you got your brake fluid here, um, battery. Um, the one thing I could not find, and which really concerned me, was my transmission fluid dipstick. Um, and on this 2014 Ford Taurus, there actually is not a dipstick for, uh, or to check the transmission fluid. But I managed to look around, search, and pull some things off here. And the way to check your transmission fluid is actually under your air filter assembly, which is located right here. So this is your air filter assembly. Um, you may be able to maneuver uh, your hand if it's small enough in between your air filter assembly here and this little spot right here, um, your coolant hose. Um, but even then, I don't think you'd get a very accurate reading because you'd be moving a lot of items around. Um, but I'm going to see if I could get a real uh, close view on it so you can get an idea. So, you know, here's your motor. Um, it's going to be right under your air filter assembly. Okay, so I managed to try to get a decent view of it. Uh, as you can see, transmission fluid only. That is going to be the area where you check your fluid levels um, and on this 2014 Ford Tauruses um, they will be able to show you it will pop up on your uh, cluster if you're having low transmission fluid or any problems with that so like I said it's right under your uh, air filter assembly right there so if you're kind of having the same uh, problem you know kind of curious to know where that's at um, that is where it is located. Please like and subscribe my videos. It helps a bunch. Uh, it keeps me uh, making more videos for you guys. Um, if you have any questions or would like to know anything else, uh, leave it in the comments. And I will try to get these videos uploaded as soon as possible. Thanks again for watching the video.